Hi, welcome back. In this video, we're going to talk about the WebEx Contact Center core feature. Now, the WebEx Contact Center, just like any other contact center, is considered to be an automatic call distribution platform or ACD. When a call comes in, it will route the call to the next available agent or for uh, to an IVR for a call treatment based on the flow that you create. So what are some of the core features? Queue management, managing the queue, like such as how many calls are should be available uh, coming into the queue, or maybe how many agents that you need, you, need to, you need to allocate a queue based on your company's needs or the volume of the calls that's gonna come in, they will be affected by your queue management. Then of course, routing type. Is this a voice call? Is it a, a web chat or is it an email? And regardless, then second, we'll be looking at whether the call is allowed at a certain time or not based on time of day routing. So these are some of these new features. So you get the queue management, the routing time, the call distribution. The call can be distributed to a particular site. And in a site, you, more than, you, you may have more than one team. So for example, you may have a, a site in London, you may have a site in Las Vegas, and each site has a one or more, a two or more separate team managing different ways. So you will need to learn how to distribute call to appropriate team based on the algorithm that you select. And then of course you have a flow builder, which is your script editor, basically the creation of the call flow. So we'll go through each one of them individually to make sure that you have a good understanding about what they are. Deposition code, like for example, if you want to, uh, you know, move, uh, take a break, or if you want to sign out early, you can put certain code that allows you to mark the deposition of it. Callback options from the script. So you have now the option to call back your client should the client decide to not wait in the queue and want a callback feature options. Agent greetings are also a new feature. Agent Desktop, which is a highly customized web interface that allows an agent to get an, uh, a very uh, user-friendly web interface to deal with the customers. Now, Agent Desktop provides agent with an experience-focused extensible agent desktop, and it has a state timer, connected channel capacity, campaign calls, notifications, all sorts of features from a single web interfaces. Now, when it comes to uh, features, the call recording, coaching, barging, these are new features. Recording can be restricted to a particular site. For example, in London, you may have two, set, two separate sites and you decided that you want to record only site one, not the site two for whatever the business case that, 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 may, that may be. Now, you can also enable multimedia channel. So you can do email, chat, voice, as well as social channel as well. You can build a virtual agent, which is a very popular feature of your web, uh, any contact center. What virtual agent does basically you know, human being on the client side to communicating with the system, which is kind of like a robot. So it's trying to understand your intent. What are you trying to uh, ask for? And based on what you're looking for, it will try to give you some answers. Now, of course, it is not a live, it is automated system. And most people nowadays know that this is basically responded by a bot or some sort of automations. Integration with the uh, CRM is a vital for pretty much any contact center solutions. Even as a small company as me, um, Voice Bootcamp, I do have integration with my uh, CRM, with my uh, WebEx account, with my uh, contact center solutions that I use. All are kind of tightly integrated. So when you go to our website, you fill up a form, for example, or you purchase a book or videos, it gets integrated with the CRM or WebEx has the ability to pull that information through that integrations. So when I build my contact center solutions with the WebEx, I could connect with my existing CRM integrations that I have and pull the necessary data that was saved because someone purchased something on our website. Yeah, reporting and dashboard, as I've, as I've shown you, that you have a very feature-rich reporting capability. It allows you to drag and drop various uh, you know, gadgets within your reporting dashboard so that you can make the web page more productive as well as functional. Now, it does provide integrations with an API so that you can make an API call to a third party. So WebEx can call the external application and external application can call the WebEx as well. The idea here is to give the developer uh, a leverage to build applications 
to either enhance the capability of the WebEx functions or give the WebEx a capability to pull data from an external source. So that's those are some of the features that we have in WebEx Contact Center. So uh, that's pretty much the introduction for that. those features. We will cover each one of these features more in depth as we go through this course.